Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Hi, I'm good. Um, my name is Ananya. I'm an intern at Leadership Initiatives. Um, I will be diagnosing and treating this patient today. No problem. You can go ahead. Okay. Um, may I ask, um, can you tell the patient um, the, the my introduction that I just did? Yes, I've, I've done that. I need consent. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Um, so, what may I ask the patient's name? Is Ismail Isa. Maya. Ismail Isa. Got it. And how old is the patient? It's nine years old. Nine years old. Can I ask the gender? Yes, you know. Okay. Um, can I ask him um, what brings him in today? What are his symptoms? Yes, it came with uh, symptoms of fever, headache. Uh, generalized body weakness, abdominal pain, diarrhea, vomiting, and uh, also dizziness. Okay. Um. Can I? What kind of fever is this? Fever is on and off. On and off. Um. Does he have any chills? Yes, there's associated with chills. Um. Are his eyelids pale? No, it's not uh, pale, but it looks. Uh, uh, pale. Uh, the palms are, are, are pale. Palms are pale. Okay. Can I run a full blood count? Yes, we've done that. Uh, two blood count shows a uh, hemoglobin of 4.6 gram per deciliter. Okay. Can I also run a um um rapid diagnostic test? Malaria parasite. Yeah. Malaria parasite done. I yeah, asked two classes of malaria process. Two classes of malaria. Okay, and can I also run the um, blood culture test? Yes, we took the sample for blood culture, but the result is not yet out. The result is, I'm sorry, I didn't hear the result. The result is yet to be out. Can you repeat that one more time? I said the result is not yet out. Not yet out. Okay. Yeah. Um, so, so far, the, it seems that this patient has malaria um, yeah. since it's with severe anemia and so the malaria is complicated. We will be needing to prescribe yes. um, IV uh, antisinate yeah, and, yeah. and IV yeah. Um For the yeah. malaria, I recommend to prevent this from happening again, I recommend um, hanging mosquito nets around the house and always using bug spray. Yeah, good. Mm -hmm. um, since this patient also seems to have um, severe anemia, we will be needing to do a blood transfusion. Yes, good. And to prevent yes, this from happening. Yes, already, yes, already has uh, 500 mils of, of blood transfusion. Okay, good. Okay, good. To prevent this from happening again, I would suggest that the patient eat iron and protein rich foods such as beans and greens and any meat that is possible to eat for him. Good. Um, it seems as though the um, patient also has typhoid fever, although the result still isn't out. If the patient does have typhoid fever, I would suggest um, Taking antibiotics such as ciprotel. Yeah, good, good, and good, to good, good, good. This from happening again. Cleanliness, hygiene, and washing hands are all very important. Yeah, good, good. Okay. Good, Thank you, so much. You, have, you have done very well. Thank you so much. Nice to, nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. Uh, great job. Thank you. Yeah. Bye. So, if you want to